My name is Craig Kissick, and I'm the Vice President of Nature and Science for Heritage Auctions. And I want to talk to you today about the day the moon landed at Heritage. This incredible specimen in my hands is actually a 17 kilogram or 37 and a half pound piece of the moon. It is not a lunar sample collected by an Apollo mission astronaut because that is owned by the federal government and administered by NASA and would be illegal, but this represents a lunar meteorite or an instance where an asteroid is flying through space, compresses the lunar surface, creates a new conglomerate sedimentary rock, pieces get blasted off the surface and make it to Earth's gravitational pull as a lunar meteorite. This was actually found by camel shepherds in the country of Mali in the year 2021. Pretty amazing story that you certainly can't make up. This represents material from the highlands, or actually sort of the, the light side of the moon. So sorry, Pink Floyd fans, it's not really from the dark side, although the back does have a beautiful, kind of richer, less bleachy coloration to it. This is a fragmental breccia. So again, it's kind of a conglomerate-based sedimentary rock. Lunar material is basically stony meteorite. It's not a metallic or an iron type meteorite like some of us are familiar with. This represents the main mass or the largest extant piece of NWA 15368, meaning this is classified as the 15,368th meteorite found in the Northwest Africa region of which only a few hundred are actually lunar in origin. Probably is, is one of, if not the largest single mass that's ever been offered at auction, and it probably is one of the larger examples of a lunar meteorite that could possibly be owned or displayed. It's an absolute beautiful specimen. It's got great texture, it's got great color, it's got great shape and form, and what it represents truly is out of this world. This and many other wonderful meteorites will be in the Heritage Natural History Auction on March 31st. Go to www.ha.com 8129 and see the exquisite items in this collection, including this one-of-a-kind museum-quality specimen. This indeed is a world-class moon rock.